Somalia, pieces of it still in Afghanistan and in Pakistan, uh, pieces of it around the world. Uh, but Osama bin Laden has been the singular face of global terrorism, anti-American terrorism for 10 years now, plus Wolf, and for a president of the United States to walk into the White House briefing room and you know, you know the level of confirmation they would require for the president of the United States right. to walk in and tell the American people and to tell the world that Osama bin Laden is dead and the United States has confirmed that. Uh, that is a huge development, a hugely significant development. It does not erase al-Qaeda from the face of the earth, but it does erase, when the president makes that announcement, announcement from the face of the earth, the singular face. Ask the people of New York City, ask the people who lost lives at the Pentagon, uh, this has been the announcement they have been waiting for for nearly 10 long years, Wolf. And, and, and let me be precise uh, that it's not just enough for the President of the United States to guess or for his top intelligence officials.